Henry Albert, Freightliner Team Run Smart Pro, and today I'd like to talk to everyone about embracing technology. Uh, recently I've been doing quite a bit of driver training at safety meetings and teaching the importance of understanding today's technology and the driver's role in enhancing it, taking the performance of today's trucks to efficiency numbers that could have only been dreamed of a few short years ago. The one thing that I found from talking to other drivers is a lot of the information they are getting is coming from other drivers while sitting around at the docks and also from the truck stop counter at the travel center. Much of this information is filled with falsehoods because a lot of the people doing the speaking have never even ridden in a truck with today's technology, nor have they ever driven one. And when you get deeper into it, in many cases, you find out that they might have had a cousin that was related to somebody else that might have known somebody who drove one of these trucks. Understanding how the new braking systems work, the stability control, the automated manual transmissions, the integrated powertrain management systems, understanding how and what their role is in maximizing the benefits of these systems makes the driver's day much more enjoyable because they're not in a fight with the technology. They're not like many of us used to be years ago while we were trying to program the VCR and kept coming up with a flashing clock. It's understanding how it works, getting the benefit out of it, learning it. And so much information today is out there to be gathered, whether it's on the videos that are on YouTube, you can find a lot on online by simply Googling up the information you're looking for. I, I shed some caution to make sure that the videos you look at are either sanctioned by your carrier or by the manufacturer of whatever component or vehicle you're looking at. It's very important as we go through this for the driver to understand and it's not replacing the driver. Everything's about enhancing the driver. And I look to the drivers to also learn how to enhance the technology. A uh, fine example is on your, what's really an automated manual transmission. So often they're called automatic transmissions and they're not an automatic transmission. They are an automated manual transmission. In fact, the clutch that they have ahead of them is the same clutch basically as we had in our manual transmissions. The internals of the transmission are the same as we had with the manuals. The only difference is it is now floating the gears by an automated shifting mechanism. It's floating the gears the same way us drivers did for years and typically it only allows for on an outside tolerance of less than 20 RPM match of the gears meshing. This makes for smooth shifts. It also makes the equipment last longer if it's used right. But so many people get into these and they want to drive them like an automatic and they're flooring the throttle. And then they start complaining that it's over revving gears. Of course it's going to over rev gears if you floored the throttle driving a manual transmission in the lower side of the gearbox, you'd over rev them too. It's understanding that it's responding to the inputs you're giving it as a driver and the terrain and the load. You're the main influencer by the message you send the equipment. If you don't understand that, there's no way for you to get the most benefit from it. and you quite possibly will find yourself aggravated as a driver. So I really want to end this, whether it's the braking systems, whether it's the collision mitigation systems, whether it's the automated manual transmissions. As we age, make sure 
that we don't put our head in the sand, make sure that we understand, that we educate ourselves. And today it's so simple, even with our smartphones sitting at the dock, to look up these different pieces of equipment, to understand how they're to function when they're functioning properly, and to understand what the end goal is in any component's design. That way we as professional drivers can enhance that technology and take it out to a level that we could never dream of at the beginning of many of our careers. Till next time, be safe. I'm Henry Albert, Team Run Smart Pro.